Hi, I'm Sasha. I'm Olga. Welcome to Thikus TV. Today we are going to give a speed demonstration of the Thikus flagship network attached storage, the N16000 NAS. With 16 bays and 48 terabytes of data, it better be able to process all that very quickly, and today we're going to show that it can. Everybody uses 1 gigabit Ethernet, and that's fast enough for the average user. But that's not who this is for. That's right. We've put this together for the place where we really need it, data centers. Current top-of-the-line NAS can transfer data just over 100 megabytes per second, but that's through 1 gigabit Ethernet. 10 gigabit is, of course, 10 times faster. So the N16000 supports 10 gigabit Ethernet over copper SFP+, like this cable here, as well as the very delicate fiber optic cables that you can see here. 10 g base t is also supported, which gives you the same speed but over the standard RG45 Ethernet cables, like this one, that everybody has around the house. The copper is cheaper, but it can only go 15 meters. 10 g base t is new to the market and is quickly replacing copper because it is even cheaper and can run up to 100 meters. The more expensive alternative is fiber, which can run tens of kilometers. And this gives companies a good range of choices for their particular needs. What IOMeter is doing right now is copying an 8 gigabyte file from the NAS into the computer. This is simulating some larger data transfers such as backups or uh, from NAS to NAS data transfers and things like that. Uh, now what you're seeing here, as I said, is read speed from the NAS. So it starts out around 1100 megabytes per second and it'll stabilize somewhere between 1100 and 1150 megabytes per second. This is really fast. So let's take a look at the write speeds. So what Iometer is doing now is the same thing but in reverse. So it's copying the same 8 gigabyte file from the computer into the NAS. Uh, as you can see the speeds are coming out around uh, 1150 to start off with, so even faster than the, than the read speeds. Um, so these are really impressive write speeds right here. Now we're going to look at some of the characteristic aspects of the N16000 that really set it apart. The major push in speed comes from the quad-core Intel Xeon 3480 processor and its 8GB of DDR3 RAM. To give reading and writing from the hard drives a big jump in speed, there is a 6 gigabit SATA and SAS controller allowing all of these powerful connections to work together with other NAS and computers, here we have installed a 10 gigabit Ethernet card. Here you can also see the built-in dual USB 3.0 connector, as well as the two DOMs, or disk on memory, that houses the system. There are two so that if one hits a snag, the other can keep everything moving without an issue. Hot swapping disks is standard on NAS these days. But on the N16000, that's not the only thing that you can remove while it's running. Both power supplies can be hot swapped. Just remember to leave one plugged in at any given time. The fans can also be swapped in and out while the NAS is running. With this hardware, you can do backups, transfer massive amounts of data in no time keeping your data safe and supporting hundreds of users at the same time. So that's the end of our demonstration. Catch up with Thikus' latest products and news on Thikus TV, Thikus.com, or our Facebook page. Thanks for watching.